Assalamualaikum. Uh, my name is Maksud Khan. I am one of the councillors uh, from the town of Oakville. And I was invited to this function here so that uh, we can appreciate how uh, the Pakistani uh, community can get involved into the, uh, the mainstream politics, into our economy, into our uh, uh, social culture. And I think that the, the important message that we've taken from here is that Pakistanis need to get more involved uh, in outreach programs, in volunteerism, in community spirits, uh, making their voice known and having an impact uh, on our community at large. Uh, I think that, uh, you know, and I've often said this, that uh, we, this is the third generation of Pakistanis now in Canada. The first generation was probably, you know, uh, here on, on, on a sense of uh, self-preservation. Uh, they were making sure that they had jobs, making sure there was food on the table, making sure they educated their children. The second generation I call is a bit more uh, selfish, I would say. Uh, their job was to, you know, to get, get more educated, post-secondary education and, and make money. Now, ultimately, we're here now at the third generation, and it's now our time to give back to the community and make sure that you know Canada at large can in, be enriched by our presence here in Canada. So uh, I encourage all Pakistanis, all Pakistanis Canadians, to get involved in the community at large. My name is Alfred Abbs. I was here today and really, really enjoyed it. There were, this was a very engaged audience. People very informed. And it's actually so great to see the Pakistani-Canadian community evolving and developing and becoming more assertive. That's what we need. And uh, today was a very interesting meeting because the quality of the debate was excellent. Okay. And uh, what, do you, what do you think that you know the community should reach out and how, how should they get involved you know, if they want to be involved in the Liberal Party? Well, well I, I think, I think that if the community, the, the community should get involved Anyway, whatever party people want to get involved with. Um, but you have to get involved locally, provincially, and nationally. And you have to be involved as a community at all levels. And I would strongly encourage people, especially if you want to make sure that the issues that matter to the community, whether they be economic issues, whether they be human rights issues, whether they be issues related to social policy and values, whatever, they should get involved because the funny thing about politics is politicians respond to those who, uh, who bring their ideas forward. Last question, how, how, how would they reach out to you if they want to come to you directly? Is there any contact, is there any link they can reach out to you, an email or a website or how, how would they talk to you? Yeah, well, anybody can, anybody can, uh, I'm, my, I do uh, my political contact all through alfredapps at gmail.com. It's the easiest way to go a hold of me, and I'm always interested, especially young Pakistani Canadians. Someone out there wants to be Prime Minister of Canada 20 or 30 years down the road, and I'd like to meet those people. Thank you so much, Alfred. Thank okay. you so much. Thank you. The Society of Pakistani Canadian Professionals and Academics uh, is a small organization and its aim is to bring people together of Pakistani origin and discuss certain ideas so that there is an informed debate on issues that relate to our life in Canada. It is not only related to the Pakistani Canadians, but it is related to life in Canada. So what we were discussing today was the liberal ideas in the 21st century. So what we are really looking at is that most of us seem to like the liberal ideas because the liberals are able to accommodate us, tolerate us, and allow us to live our lives in a multicultural manner. Are we able to adopt the Canadian values to the same degree? Is liberalism changing in the 21st century? Since 9-11, have the liberal ideas been modified? Is it that we are not welcome here anymore? So there are a number of other issues. Last time that we talked about was the reasonable accommodation in democratic traditions. We had Professor Fadil talk about it. And there we also wanted to know what is it that we can do or shouldn't be doing in this new country? Should we be taking part in Liberal Party or Conservative Party? Are the two parties entirely different? So there are a number of issues that we talk about. This society has been in existence for about 30 years, and you can go to the website 
uh, of Society of Pakistani Canadian Professionals and Academics. You can become a member if you want to take part in it. You are very welcome. Uh, we welcome every individual who can contribute positively. So, if you think that you have ideas, please uh, go to the website and send us an email. Thank you very much.